Hi Year 11, I'm going to talk to you about music, BTEC, music GCSE, dance and drama qualifications and how to revise or get the best out of your external assessments. I'll start with music BTEC. Uh, you have already sat the unit one exam, so you are already well aware of some of the revision techniques I suggested like playing games or making flashcards and using all of the resources that I've put on Google Classroom for you to access. If that exam doesn't go to plan and you need to do it again, then we will re-enter you for May and we need to do exactly the same things. Use Quizlet to go over the keywords and job roles. Do job roll dominoes until you are blue in the face. You need to then play battleships and do all of the fun things and just keep those words in your head. All we have left to do is another item of coursework for this course. We've got to do Unit 5 Performance, so there are no other revision strategies that I can suggest to you for that course. Music GCSE though, um, we have summary pages that we've done for each of the set works. It's a really good idea to look, cover, write, check with those when you have five minutes, do a piece. We like to listen to the piece first and whilst we're listening to it, write down as many things as we can remember. The other thing is to use the Quizlet to think of the glossary key terms all of the time. The musical words are what get you the marks, so use them as often as possible. There's a Twitter account that I will tell you about for you to follow, a word of the day, it's really exciting. So keywords, go over them as often as possible, make flashcards, mind maps, summaries, as often as you can. And finally, I'm going to talk to you about dance and drama. So the component three external assessment is your exam. And there's not revision as such, but more strategies to help you succeed as best as you can. Mr. Carter and Miss Thomas will be purchasing these guides that you can buy from them. In them are loads of examples of what your written external assessments should look like. Really good idea to buy one of those, to read through them, and to try and make your work look like the inside of this book does. The other really important thing to do is to make notes after every lesson as to what skills you've used and what ideas you've had. And these notes you can then take into your controlled written assessments as part of component three. So the notes are really important. Keep making notes every single lesson. The more you make, the more marks you'll get for the decisions that you made. Good luck.